And that was Burn Baby Burn, a request from one of our lovely loyal listeners, Sharon. Our thoughts are with you on your husband's cremation today. Isn't that sweet? If you have a request for us, email us at Peter Pecan Golden Hour every other Friday at radiofunky.co.uk or tweet us at Peter Pecant, as Peter Pecan was already taken. And now, a little bit of this. Hi, Jerry. Your sausages look a handful. Oh, they are, Judith. Made with 100% British pork. Grab his sausages with both hands and head on down to Jerry's Meat Market today. I think I can only manage the one. <laughs> so you see, Peter, after the summer of 2012, when my poor wife Maggie died, my days have been so long. I thought about joining the naturist community, because I love the outdoors, you see. I know the difference between a blue tit and a thrush. But the tits I saw that day... Sorry to cut you off there, um... Arthur, it was me uncle's name. Me mother and him were very close, you see. Anyway, it were full of naked freaks with the bits hanging out. There was this one lad who was waving his... Sorry to interrupt you there, Arthur, but we're actually calling to find out how you pronounce it. Is it scone or scone? I once knew a lad who had kidney scones. Had a hard time pissing. Oh no, it seems we lost Arthur there. No, I'm still here. I'll tell you who I lost recently, and that was my pet cat. He was a stupid cat. It turned out he was mentally disabled, so I thought it'd be easy to put him down. You look happy, Stephen. Oh, I am. I've just sorted out my funeral with not long left funeral cover. Oh, really? Tell me more. It was super easy, meaning when I'm gone, my family won't have to worry about my rotting corpse. It's all sorted. My, oh, my, that's handy. I'll look into it. Good idea with your weight. (laughs) (laughs) They have a 24-hour hotline, so you can call them any time. I might just do that. Not long left funeral cover. Making your death easy for everyone. Hey then, dinner's ready. I won't have long left with her cooking. <laughs> so you see, Peter, it was an easy mistake to make. So, usually at these charity events, I do some fun games. This time, I picked musical chairs. Everyone knows musical chairs, you think? No. So, when the music starts, Everyone gets up, doing a bit of dancing, and then when the music stops, you sit down. But a couple of the kids didn't know the rules of the game, so what I did was I gave a couple of them a gentle push. Yeah, I doubt I'll be doing many charity events after that, especially with the uh, disabled. So how much money did you raise from this event? Raise? Shit. Okay, do you have a song request that you've got for all these kids that you've wronged? One of my favourites, the kids love this one, always dancing away. Elton John's I'm Still Standing. Ooh, maybe not. Okay, here's Elton John's I'm Still Standing. Peter, do you know how hard it was to find your fucking studio? The Radio Funky sign wasn't a big giveaway. Radio Funky? It says Radio Fuck outside. Shit. Sean, someone's defaced the sign again. I'm a family entertainer, man. Do you know how bad it is for my image? I think it's worse for your image pushing disabled kids out the wheelchairs. How dare you speak to me like that? I'm a family entertainer! I'm never going to be booked again if this comes out. You fucking twat! At Furniture Corner, you can get great deals on all hardwood furnishings, like cupboards and tables. Even if you're scared of chairs, these deals are too good to miss. Ah! Aren't they, Tony? Head on down to Furniture Corner today. Hardwood has never felt so good. And I can confirm, Wendy. Oh, yeah. You got yourself a marvellous 18 points. Oh, So yeah. up next on line two, we've got Julie. Hello, Julie. Julie. Hello, Julie. Hello. 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 Hello? Hello? Julie, can you hear me? Yes. Great, should have just said so. So, uh, Julie, do you think you can beat Wendy's impressive 18 and win yourself a Radio Funky novelty pen? No. Right. 
Well, I'm sure you'll do better than you think. So, Julie, you've got one minute on the clock and your time starts now. Which chocolate bar shares the name of a planet in our solar system? Um, Wayne Rooney. Uh, no, close. It was Mars. Which famous singer was originally part of the Jackson 5? What was it, Velma? Uh, no, it was Michael... Jim um, Keys. Jackson. What day of the week comes between Wednesday and Friday? Quavers. No, Julie, can you actually hear me? Yes. Do we count that as correct? Have a one. Have one. Uh, no, I've Julie, won. we're on to the next question. Um, I've got another tip in, darling. Uh, Julie? Julie? I think she's gone. Oh, I didn't see you there. I'm Evelyn Gonzalez, famous Broadway star. You may know me from Chitty Chitty Bang Bang as the flying car and the talking toothbrush in Beauty and the Beast, and many more. Well, come on down to Evelyn's really great singing class in the back room of the community center after Weight Watchers and before Alcoholics Anonymous, where I'll be if you want to grab a drink after class. Email me on Evelyn has really nice hair at hotmail.com. But before I go... And now everyone can have a bowl of spaghetti on the house. In other more local news, vandals have decided to deface the Radio Funky sign again. Well, we've got you on CCTV, so we will find you and we will prosecute you. There's nothing funny about changing Radio Funky into Radio Fuck. Sorry for my language. But if the vandals could return the letter Y, it would be appreciated, as it means we could get a refund on the sign. In other more sad news, Oakmoor Retirement Home recently caught fire, killing seven and injuring three elderly people. However, suspicions of arson and foul play have surfaced over the owner, Clive Chives. And now, a song request from Clive. Billy Joel's We Didn't Start the Fire. I never thought I'd find a man at my age. Not until I found Late Life Lovers, a free-to-join dating site for people over 60, with only a few additional charges on top. I thought after my wife died in a suspicious car accident, I'd never love again. But thanks to the easy process at Late Life Lovers, I was getting remarried again and again it's and simple. again. simple. All you again. need to do is put in your name, credit card details, medical history and a copy of your will. And our high-tech system will find you your new lover. Let your love life light up with Late Life Lovers, proud partners of Oakmore Retirement Home. I just don't understand why you keep changing your name. What was wrong with Count Radio? Unfortunately, Pauline, a quick rebrand was needed after some troubled youth stole the letter O from our Count Radio sign, creating a rather crude name. So what makes you think Radio Fuck is any less crude? Hello, next caller. Is it pronounced scone or scone? Hello, Peter. It's me, Arthur. We seem to have lost connection. Do you know that someone's changed your sign to read as Radio Fuck? Don't you hate annoying neighbours? I can't stand mine. Always trimming his edges early in the morning. I've tried everything to get him to stop. Asking him nicely, stealing his head trimmer, throwing stuff through his windows. There's nothing I can do. There's one thing. Sell your house with its just bricks and move to a new neighbourhood today. Bye, Simon. I'm moving house. So am I. Just make sure to meet your new neighbours first. Oh, no. Simon, what are you doing here? I'm moving in. So am I. Looks like we're neighbours again. Better go get started on these edges. Oh, no. It's just bricks. Great to throw through windows and building houses. The hunt for the Samuel family is now over, as their bodies have washed up on the shores of France, of all places. <clears throat> the local R&LI team said they did all they could, but have got a message for those travelling to the beach this weekend, which is, don't rock the boat. Uh, can I have a word, Peter? Go baloney with Tony Maloney at Tony's Fun Park, just off the M6. <laughs> Play with Tony's balls in Tony's ball pit, or why not slide down Tony's fun tubes? Enter Tony's magical wizarding world with Wizard Boy. You can hold Tony's wand 
and learn how to fly. Tony's Fun Park. Great fun for all the family. Visit kidsplaywithtony.co.uk to find out more. It's so much fun, you'll never leave.